Hi guys, it's Marianne, the Frugal Chef. Hey, I'm back in La Paz. I am jet lagged. Uh, you have no idea. I've been through so many time zones that my body is completely confused. But here I am. It's time to start working again. And I just wanted to give you guys a little update of what's going on. First thing, I want to apologize for my last video and the sound the between the waves and the wind. I know it was very hard to understand. But by the time I edited it, I, you know, I did it the day before we left, it was too late for me to do anything about it. So I figured, you know, rather than disappear on you, uh, I'd uh, annoy you <laughs> with a video you couldn't, li you, you couldn't, you know, really make out. Uh, I know somebody was all concerned about the flies in my face. Well, those really weren't flies, you know, they were more like gnats. It is the tropics there. And, uh, well, I was trying to get them out of my face. So, anyways, um, let's see. Let's talk about the book first. The book is published. The, the publisher had a little miscalculation on how much it was going to cost him. And it is, it's quite high in price. We do have a Kindle version, uh, you know, an e-book, an e uh, which you can buy through Amazon and through my website. With, you know, the button is on the header of the website. And if you have an iPad or one of the Kindle Fires now, you know, it, it, it looks really, really good. So if you want to buy it, that, it's at $9.99. Um, it's there for you. It's a big book. It's about 300 and some pages. And um, so the problem is it's too expensive. The solution is uh, we're going to start making like little smaller versions of that one book uh, and sort them out by subjects like, you know, soups and sandwiches, there's a whole section on, on uh, you know, uh, tips for saving money, on essential things that I think you should have in your pantry, your kitchen, essential kitchen uh, items, you know, for people that are starting out, what you don't necessarily need to have a full deck, fully, you know, uh, I can't talk, it's the jet lag. <laughs> you don't need to have a kitchen that's got everything in it, but you do need some essential things in order to be able to cook. So anyways, we're going to be uh, cutting it up into smaller books. I don't really want to spend a lot of time on that right now. Uh, it, it, I am a little disappointed, if I must say. Uh, but we'll, we'll see how that goes. I will let you know when those are up, okay? Up and ready to buy. Um, let's see, what else? Uh, I told you I was going to meet with Rocky Barragan and with Señor Pipa de La Paz. And unfortunately, that did not work out. Um, Rocky was sick and her brother was coming into town and you know my flight was delayed by eight hours in Fiji and uh, we could you know by the time I got to LA everything I needed to do that day I couldn't do but anyways uh, it, it was impossible that was a little disappointing I was really really excited to do that maybe next time um, the cooking classes, those I will let you know when they're when they're ready. I think I'm going to be moving to another house. I'm pretty sure, actually. I will sort that out this week, hopefully. And so, you know, I, I need to set up, um, uh, you know, special internet for that. And I'm not going to do it in this house if I'm leaving. So I'll let you know. Uh, let's see what else. Um, right after this video, I will have a food video for you. And, you know, I'll start up uploading food here. Um, I started two new channels and uh, you know one of them is Cocina Frugalista and the other one is My Life My Views. Both of the buttons are on top of this channel if you want to sub. I will start putting videos on that this week as well. Uh, Cocina Frugalista is all my Spanish speaking videos. I'm uh, not necessarily going to be repeating stuff that I'm doing for the Frugal Chef. Uh, I, I think what I'm going to do is start making Spanish versions of all the Latin food I have on this channel. Uh, and then, you know, we'll see. But anyway, I will have videos there this week if you want to sub. Um, the other one, a lot of people have been asking me about my life. And I thought it would be fun if we had a channel where, okay, I'll, I'll you know, I, I've been giving you little tidbits. It won't be all about me, 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 me. <laughs> we'll talk about me. But I also thought it'd be fun if we had a place where we could talk about, you know, everything from attitudes to the power of the words that come out of our mouth. And, you know, where we could all just uh, have an opinion. And I think it'd be fun. I think we'd have a nice, friendly community there. I'm telling you from now, you know, it'll be troll-free. Uh, 
<laughs> it's anyway we'll deal with that later finally I have an excess of a thousand emails in my inbox uh, you have no idea how many emails I get every day and between traveling I really didn't do much for emails so I will be answering those shortly here it'll take me a while to catch up I like to personally thank subscribers you know for subbing to me I have a lot that I haven't done yet and I apologize for that I would like to now verbally thank all of you that are new to the channel I really appreciate your sub and you know all of you that been there already you all know that I appreciate you guys from the bottom of my heart and I I'm so grateful for your support all right guys I better start working <laughs>